I have an urgent message for anybody out there that does not have solar yet. This is an urgent message from the CEO of Peak Power USA. That's me, Dingo. Right now, the California Public Utility Commission, the CPUC, is in negotiations with the utility companies to change the rate structure for individuals who are planning on going solar in the very near future. How near? January of 2022. That is right around the corner. If you do not have solar, but you're considering it, I implore you to please pull the trigger as soon as physically possible so that you can maximize what solar can do for you financially. Let me do a quick explanation for you. Solar is produced. I have solar panels on my roof. It's coming down into my inverter. It's going into my house. If my house doesn't need it, it then goes onto the grid as overproduction. The grid is my battery, which stores my power for later. There are two fees that come with this. It's called the NEM 2.0 rate structure. Uh, I am charged around $10 a month for being connected to the grid, no matter what. I can't do anything about that. And for every kilowatt hour that my solar system produces that I don't use that goes onto the grid, I'm charged around two cents per kilowatt hour. That is very cheap. I am very happy with that pricing structure. The proposed change, which is the reason for the urgency, is that the new rate structure called Net Metering 3.0 or NEM 3.0 is going to take that $10 a month that we're currently paying and it's going to increase it to $75. That really upsets me and it should upset everybody. I get it. I get that the utility companies need to make their money and sustain their business model. Totally get that. But that doesn't change the fact that you can beat them to the punch. Okay? You've just got a very limited amount of time, but you can completely win the game of solar. But you've got to act now. The other change, you know that two cents a kilowatt hour that I'm being charged for storing my overproduction on the grid? That amount is also going to change. Um, I can't give you that exact number yet because nobody knows what it's going to be, but they're estimating anywhere from 50 to 80% uh, decrease in savings um, on that overproduction. So uh, 50 to 80%, uh, either one of those numbers is not good. That's not, I'm not okay with that, and you shouldn't be either. So if uh, you wanna win the game of solar, you wanna maximize your savings, um, I implore you, Choose solar, choose solar today. Don't wait. The waiting game is, is over. Uh, you, you've got to do this now if you want to beat them to the punch. January 2022 is the cutoff. That is when they will make their decision. That is when it will go into effect. So don't wait, don't hesitate. Choose solar, choose solar right now. Thank you.